All right, guys. Welcome everyone to BenQ C Go for Dota Two Cups, and we have Lucidus Idol versus Veron International. And joining me is Kai Promo. Are you there, man? Radiant Team Ban. But we got a pretty standard ban coming out from both teams here. Um, if it is ISO, we'll be going for the ban on Doom and uh, we're on gonna go the ban on Pan. Radiant Team Pick. Uh, really? Alright. The thing is, there's this um, Lycan is still in the pool here. I'm not sure what both teams doing, but pretty sure they pick up a Lycan here. Lycan, even though he got a slight nerf, he is still pretty much um, OP, I think. Right, um, Ido gonna take a little bit of time here. Reserve time. Oh, they really um prioritize this hero a lot. Even in the West, um, Scarf Mage is pretty OP. Um, yes, especially the silence. It is around a few seconds long, and this is a really good um bursting hero. You can burst a hero right away. Like, yep. And then very on here on the other on the other hand they're gonna pick a one two punch support AA plus Earthshaker. Pretty gets a uh, great synergy here. Fisher into a problem. Cold feed <laughs> the ice blast. Dire team ban. Test. Alright, my test, I can hear you now. You there man? Yep, I can hear you. Radiant team ban. Dire team ban. Trying to speak louder. All right. Um, looking at the bands here. Um, silencer, wiper. I I really like the wiper band because um. It's a hero that uh, pretty much can own a 1v1 lane. Reserve time. Well, we're on here. I also like their ban here, the Faceless Void. Um, Faceless Void, really a great synergy with um, Skyraf Mage. Um, he can set up for the um, Skyraf Mage ultimate, which is a Mystic Flare. Well, um, Ember Spirits. I'm not sure whether um, Ember Spirit should be banned out because I think he got a really huge nerf. It's not that good now, anyways. And very around here, they will be looking to pick up a probably a carry or even a solo mid or even an off laner. They got their supports. So all they need here is a solo mid. But. Lycan is still in the pool, so one they can get it. So Kai Promo, what do you think? Um any suggestions? What do you think they will pick up? I Reserve time. Look at pick up as you look at a lineup. Radiant team pick. Um, yep, uh, we're on here. They're gonna go with the call Mirana here. Um, with this three heroes pick up, um, in serious idol, 
They can see an aggressive trilling coming to their way. Oh, Tasca. 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 Uh, with the 4th pick for Veron here, they will be looking to pick their um, probably a solo mid or even a with uh, Mirana plus Earthshaker plus Ancient Operation. They can go in aggressive trialing here if they want. So they can pick up their a safe lane or even a solo mid first. Walker is still in the pool if uh, we then play Walker. With this uh, Knight's pick up here, they completely change the direction of their um, line up here. Probably a Solumid Mirana. If this um, Light Stealer pick up, I really not a fan of this Light Stealer. He's gonna have a hard time against this Sky Rough Mage. Wh why in the world would you pick this um, Light Stealer against a Sky Rough Mage? You get silence, you can't reach at all. Meanwhile, um, in serious here. If this Dragon Knight pick up, um, wait. Are you kidding me? So, life still, uh, with this Dragon Knight pick up here, they probably would want to go for a... Solo mid Dragon Knight and Fire of Mage plus Sand King plus Tuskahe can be an aggressive trident. This hero, these three heroes are really aggressive. Radiant team ban. I'm not sure why would they ban Razor unless they want to pick a OD for themselves or something. Dire team pick. They want to pick an OD. Oh, Meepo, guys. Meepo is in the house. What? 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 Guys, we have a sniper and a Meepo. What a game. Dire team pick. Game was nice until these two heroes get picked up. We have a sniper versus a Meepo here. I'm really keen to see this um, Meepo player. How good he is. Um, all right, taking a look at their lanes line up here. I can see it's a Meepo solo mid or even a safe lane Meepo is still possible. And I think their lanes are really versatile for Veron. But on the other hand, in Serious Idol, um, you're gonna go with the Probably this uh, three heroes, Sky of Mage plus Sand King plus Tuskar is a good um, aggressive violin hero. Alright, let's introduce the team here. On the raiding side, we have Insidious Idol. They're gonna walk S5, gonna find some pick off, but they're walking into their own jungles here, so they want to defend their jungle. Want, they don't want any walls in there. Um, on the Sand King here, we have Z Red. On the sniper we have Chu, and on the Skyrath Mage we have. Mm, 
Netherrond. On the DK, we have Yasera. And last but not least, on the Tusca, we have Shagasaurus. Alright. Well, it looks like they get smoke up here for very long. They are coming in. Linger, charging up the sun, uh, charging up the Meepo here. And we have Meepo. Oh, it looks pretty bad for Insidious Arrow. And the arrow is going to lash here. And this Tusca is gone. Tusca, what are you doing? Tusca, no praise. That level 1 chilling touch is doing a lot of work. And, and everyone, they, they are not done here, they want more. But nope, I don't think they will get more. So I'll introduce the rest of the team here. Um, on this Meepo, we have Linger. On the carry life steal we have MYE and Pinks is coming up from Sand King. They know it is warded, and it looks like an aggressive trilane coming from Veron. If um, Junior on the Mirana, Double U on the Earthshaker. Last but not least, Stan in Dial Dial on the um, support ancient abrasion. Uh, what? I'm gonna do some next level creep pool here. Get a pretty good. Uh, I'm gonna get a pretty good lane. Here. But it's it is against a um, life stealer, life stealer versus any um, strength hero. It's gonna do really well. So fights for its life. This sniper need to place uh, really safe. Because he's uh, up against an aggressive trilane and Sniper is not a hero that uh, can do really well against the aggressive trilane. And Sand King is not even in this lane, so it's a 3 against 2 here. Not sure whether they can go in this lane. Sniper, you're out of position, you might just die here. And you're gonna die. Arrow's gonna latch, nope, arrow's gonna miss. Let me shake your hand. Uh, taking a look at the last hits here. Um, Tuska is still leading up the last hit list. Followed by Meepo. Meepo. Uh, solo me Meepo. So exciting to see here in competitive game. And look at this. It's a sniper versus, uh, versus 3 here about this sniper couldn't even get out from his tower all right they're wrapping around for this um um people here i don't think he can survive this nope nice net but the dragon breath gonna kill him and the second blood goes to yasera and blood sniper opt to go for a level 2 shrapnel here um, usually when I play um, Sniper, I would uh, max tech, uh, take aim first. I would. I would max take aim and then follow by headshot. I will only get level 1 on Shepner, but well. Um, they are comp uh, pro players, so um, I should follow them. So, see how does this go? We say no. Uh, he gets this to I think pretty much to save himself from the nukes and pre uh, pretty much escape the um, the slow movement, uh, the slow the movement speed of the enemies. Sand King, what are you doing, Sand? Meanwhile, top lane here, a Nike versus Tusca. Not a really fun lane for Tusca, but doing pretty well. And however, um, Life Stealer is doing better. He has more last hits. No, no, no. This this sniper, and he's still a level two Sand King. Oh, 
Oh, massive stack for Meepo here. Oh, OP, yo. Hit lane here taking uh, the last hits uh, pretty much even. Oh, uh, DD, DD. On Yasera. Earthshaker and Inspiration wrap around here to mid lane and there are pings from Earthshaker Earthshaker is wrapping around here Sarah? Sarah you better play properly Don't go past the river Once you go past that you can't come back anymore Over And the spots from where on here, they are just wasting the time. But great map awareness coming up from um, DK. But meanwhile, at top lane, Tascal is gonna fall. But can Yasera get a return kill here? Can he? Nope. Can't. And they really want to go onto this Scarf Mage. Can. This is um, taking a look at the uh, gold difference here. Pretty much pairing we're on by around 800 gold. All the lanes are doing well for um, we're on. This me oh meanwhile bot lane is so lucky onto the sniper. I think probably his arrow latch and then he just get his easy Dire easy kill on this um, sniper. Dire structures are fortified. Doom is Dyer's top tower is feeling its mortality. Oh, oh quad stack. No, this more than quad stack, I think. Quad stack for Meanwhile, mid lane here. Dyer's top and tower Earthshaker's is under gonna attack. fall again. It fights for its life. Four is one to Three four, fairing we're on. Is under attack. Radiant's bottom tower is under attack. There is little it can do. Meanwhile, here they want to get a support. Yep, they will get it. Easy, easy kill. Radiant's bottom tower is fading fast. Radiant's bottom tower is under attack. Well, a massive stack everywhere for this uh, Meepo. They find him. Want to steal this stack? This idol. Look at this stack. Yummy, yummy stack. Oh, they have a ward here for uh, Veron. They know this gang is coming, so better be prepared. Jessica, you don't want to go onto this um, run, I believe it. He's out of position here. He might just fall here. Arrow? Arrow's not gonna latch. This might be a turnaround for the serious idol. They're gonna get a kill here. Great. Counter initiation coming up from Insidious Idol. Well, Meepo just casually walking around. He want this stack. Yummy, yummy stack. Alright, this sniper is gonna go down here. Radiant gonna get open wound and Fisher in the face. There's no way he can escape this. Just buying some time for their teammates. Yeah. Oh, mid lane here. Um, Yasera is gonna get net. The Meepo is coming in. Radiant's bottom tower is under attack. Arrow is gonna ledge here, bottom tower has fallen. and he's gonna fall. Viran's gonna get a kill. Meanwhile, bot lane here. Tuska get, got a kill into this ancient abrasion. Uh, there's an infest. Get out from infest. And they're gonna get an easy, easy kill into this life stealer. Um, Santi, pretty close to his uh, dagger. Only around hundred gold away. 
So it's a pretty fast uh, dagger here. Nine minutes. Nine minutes dagger. Not bad. Librarian maxing the shrapnel. This is a really unusual build. Is under attack. I'll try to learn it from him. Actually, shrapnel does a lot of damage. But then, if you want damage, you go for headshot. And you need a lot of mana for shrapnel, so... Not sure whether it's a good choice. Then he's gonna get pushed up by Joanna. Well, mid lane here, um, the tower is half HP, and Becerra's gonna get, uh, gonna have his Radiant's ultimate again. Under so he will want to push this uh, this tower. He want Fire's the tower go for his teammates. But there's an invisible rune on ancient abrasion, and there's a stun onto this Earthshaker, and uh, this Earthshaker is dead. Rest in peace. We are getting caught out of positions. There is Bling dagger onto it. So the next team fight is will be pretty much crucial for Serious Arrow. We want to get this um great epic center and bling into Boral Strike. And pretty much pretty much wipe the team. Wait, they're pinging out Meepo here. And Tuska is going in. They see it, they see food. All they see is food and this People, yep. I think the problem is they have no ward in their jungles at all. Later on, they only have one ward here. Really enough. Well, last hit wise, still favoring. Um, Meepo is still on top of the last hits, but the kills in Serious Idol is definitely catching up. Hyper gonna free farming bot catching up on last hit. Only have 30 last hits. Well, I've catch up the Meanwhile here DK has picked up the um great club. Going straight for BKB here. Yep. Arrow? But they have a ball here. It's gonna fall here. Stun. Your phase Whoa, Shrapnel is doing a lot of damage. Assassin is gonna latch here. It's gonna might fall here. Pretty close. Need a stun. Arrow's gonna lash onto this Sand King, and Sand King is gone forever. Terra. Still level 9. He, he will, really wants his. um. Level 11 as soon as possible so they can cover easy. Earthshaker is gonna get caught out here. And he's got, but however, this Tuska is gonna arrow, get arrow in the face. And this is looking pretty bad for. But. Looking. Nope, it's still a 3 for 2 favoring Veron. Um, at least DK got a uh, uh, the gold bounty on the uh, Mirana Mega Skill. Pretty easy goal for him. I'll walk back. I'll pick up his uh, hammer. Oh, what's the. It's the um, Immortal Dragon Skill. Uh, working towards the uh, jump. Book. What's? Yeah, really playing really aggressive here for this idol. 
really want to jump onto this. Awesome. I still it. Don't get stunned. Don't get busted down. Rage. And Ice Blast gonna latch on two here. This is looking pretty bad for Insidious Idol. This guy is running for his life, but he doesn't know that. But nope. There's no like counter initiation coming up from around here. You pop up the moon like shadow. I should still go back in here. Banking? Banking gonna stun here. It was a two man fissure here. Um, Radiance top tower is under Radiance top tower. It's still a one for one favoring DK. Still a one for one favoring in serious idol. Change a support for a carry life stealer, so worth it. But Mirana is gonna be looking around on kill here. Arrow, sink arrow. What's coming? And they have a they have a ward here, so it's really important. Oh, a fifteen minutes Aghanim scepter for Meepo here, so four Meepo guys. Yes, four Meepo now. Five. And they are walking straight into the jungle here. This is really cocky coming up from Insidious Idol. And they they will find this um, our position of shape and that's what really need, uh, in serious I don't need the most he really wants this um, kick off he really need it the line up here is based on um, killing bursting down one hero and, and Senki might help the uh, quite a little bit but once Meepo come back in and probably he's gonna pick up a blink next so he can get nearer to the sniper he can burst him down really easily top lane here I was gonna, gonna go down they have dragon form so. arrow? arrow's gonna not gonna latch here with map awareness coming up from Yasero I was gonna get denied Dyer's what? Tower has been denied. please Yasero I was gonna get denied. Let's still go for the Insidious Idol. Well, oh, bot lane here. Haze rune on Meepo, Meepo. Gonna casually escaping. I'm taking a look at the levels here. Let's take a look at the levels comparison. The supports are on the same level, but they are, the calls from Insidious Idol are level 10 compared to the level 11 they're on If they have any more smoke, have all their smoke. Have the smoke, they would right into one. Have no more smoke, I think. Alright, the love of his probably working towards the hell storm. Alright, smoke, more smoke coming. Serious idol. Really, really need off. Meanwhile, Mirana here already has yeah. ice here. It's drum plus armlet. Great um early game items. Takes around uh, one thousand gold away. In dagger. Then ancient abrasion saving up for probably an algorithm scatter. I pick up. Oh, Meepo's gonna get picked off here, and he's gone. Gone. Did they use the smoke for it? Nope. Just um greedy coming up from uh, Meepo, just farming in jungles. Radiance middle tower is under attack. And this five still want to attack. exchange our and this 
Life Stealer is gone. He has no mana to rage. Has fallen. Radiant's top tower is under attack. All things considered, this is a really good uh, trade for for Insidious Idol. They defended their towers, get a kill onto the life stealer plus bottom to one tower. Sniper, sniper's gotta do a lot of damage. Can actually um uh kill all the five heroes from Veron if they are not focusing him at all. But then how do you focus a sniper when there's a Tasca to stun your teammates? But I, I, but I still think it's a really close game for uh, both teams here. So the scores now is 13 to two, uh, 12. And goal, different voice. The voice is uh, walking, uh, go, coming back to the way of um, Judas Idol. This is gonna latch, Ice Blast gonna miss. Well, so, so have 1.9k. The bank probably smoke up here. Serious, uh, in serious, I uh, smoke up as 5. They wanna jump onto this Veron here. Do they have any vision? Okay. Blink Dagger is done on Meeple. I think they wanna smoke too. Right? They have smoke on Asia. Yep, there is smoke here. They might just walk into right into each other here. Sand King, Sand King. Nope, they know a moonlight shadow has been popped here. Do they have any sentry? Sentry, sentry, sentry. Nope, no sentry. They're gonna back off. Back off right now. It is either back off. No sentry. But then, on the other hand, here we're on just gonna play safe too. People, people, who is going for some big plays here? He's gonna walk right back behind here. He has a blink dagger, and with a mip, with a next, next, he get busted down right away. This meeple. Uh, meanwhile, for next on our list is next. He's gonna charge up his epic center, but it's not gonna do much. But still do some damage. And this is looking pretty bad for Veron here. They're gonna get Team Viper. And probably a Ultra Kill. Nope. Ultra Kill on Yesera here. And they will get this tier 2 tower. That was a really bad team fight coming from uh, Veron. They missed the arrow and people just casually jumping into 5. To 5 heroes. What a play. That, that next. Uh, that life sphere gets kited around by the um, dra dragon tail. He couldn't do anything at all. And Dragonite has 3.7k in the bank here. He can go for a Maelstrom or straight um, Assault Kuras. Alright, Maelstrom is done on Sniper. Actually, Veron has been doing really well up till that fight where they got team vibe. Get kited to them so much. This is a really bad choice. Picking Lysero when there's a star of mage. Really sad life for him. Once he gets silenced, he's pretty much useless. Sarah, you have 4.k. What are you gonna buy here? Direct, Blink Dagger. Star of Mage towards the first star. Ah. Drum working towards the BKB too. Yep, BKB can um, reduce a lot of damage. Radiance top tower is under attack. Ah, uh, poof, poof, yeah. Dyer's bottom tower is under attack. This this tower is falling fast thanks to the grapnel and the dragon form. Easy, easy. 
Now we'll go. He'll defend this. He'll want to. But he can get. Dyer's bottom tower is under attack. Yep, it'll be an assault crew has come here from Dragon Knight. Finally, finally. Bring dagger. Will we see some a uh, big echo slam here? They really need that um big five man echo slam. Ice blast into Pretty much team white for in serious. In the next team fight in serious idol position themselves really well. Wait. Oh top lane here, sniper, sniper, what are you doing? Sniper is gonna get raped here. There's an ice blast. Wait. Oh at least they got a kill onto the Meepo. Oh, two men echo slam here. This is looking pretty bad for Insidious Idol. It'll be a. Get stunned here. Can he run away from this? Nope, he got to get blocked by the Fisher here. And it will be an easy, easy kills for Veron. That was questionable. He's coming over. Casually walk into the enemy jungle without any vision, like sentry. Got shadow. Yeah, great echo slam coming from Earthshaker. Probably gonna get this tier one tower here, Radiant but they have um fortified. fortification. Arrow, arrow is gonna fly here. They gotta stun onto this. Gonna get pop here, and he's doing a lot of damage. Even the sniper is doing a lot of damage. However, DK is gonna fall anyway. It's a 2 for 2, no 2 for 1 here. They didn't... Oh, they got a stun on this Earthshaker. Earthshaker has 400 HP. Gonna die? Nope, he, he just dodged the... Sniper assassination, so... The blink. Oh, Mirana get a kill. Nice arrow. Wait, he... Ultimate... Oh. Testing a hey. uh, hex or something? Try a voice. But then I of Scotty is also possible. But I will see a I'm I'm definitely thinking of um uh, hex here. Sniper. Has fallen to the dive. Sniper is pretty fat here. He has his uh, Mojo near. Only. Oh, well, Tasca, just. Talk. This sniper is going to do a lot, a lot of damage. However, they need the whole Veron team focusing on this um, tanky hero like Tascar and not focusing on him at all, so he's gonna do a lot of damage. He should really get a mass of madness. Just full YOLO. Pups, I would. Mass of madness into just raping everyone. Yeah. Pop lane here. Maybe because he get pop on Tasca and he's gonna fall. But Shadow wasn't you. Ah, that was. Meepo. Level twenty. Nice. Pop. Thinking. Looking in the tree. And they might know this. Do you have any map hack here? They're really, really close to each other. Radiance top tower is under attack. Map hack. Sniper scan. Yep. It's a pinging him out. Back off.
Okay, here. Finally, level 16. First dragon. Taking a look at the net worth there. Actually, it's not Meepo who's on top of the list. It's actually Anna. There you go. Hex on. Well, um, on top of the net worth there is Anna, followed by DK, followed by Go, and then followed by uh, it looks like they want to defend their top lane here. Next onto this uh, Sand King. This Sand King is gone. Nope, he's not gone. Very gone. Gone. Whatever. Piper is going to get chased down by this. Rana is pretty fat. Huh? He knows this. Oh, double damage. Oh, a lot, a lot of damage. Oh, who's gonna get caught? Huh? He's gonna get raped here. Done, busted down. But here's the Aegis. But Tuska, I'm gonna fall. I think they have Epic Center. Yep, he has Epic Center here. See this. Arrow? Uh, uh, burst down this tanking. Get Hex. I get busted down really fast. But on the back line here, the, um, Yusera managed to get a gun to the. But they managed Radiant to balance one meeple. Out. And this, this sniper is doing a lot of damage. Uh, clean up everything. That's one problem um, for uh, Viron here. Really need to focus this sniper a bit of damage. Not sure what he's going next. Probably a Manta here. Okay. Have the ultimate op. Error. S is a assault QRS. That's three. Hey, go. It was his good. Okay, yeah, hard here. Hard is still possible. Or. That is. I pick up a river. Yep, there you go. River. Dodo, best Dodo. Brown has walks everywhere. This um late game. Two map controllers. They know exactly where's in Sido. He's uh using a bots. Well um. Dyer's top tower. Yes, I don't gonna Shadows take us. Gonna go up as five. Want to put in here. They do it. Can they do it? Do they have any sentry? Do they have any detection? And next just walking in. Any four stuff, four stuff, four stuff. Four stuff, four stuff. Yep, there's four stuff. And this earth shaker's gonna do a lot of damage. Oh, he's this sniper is gonna do a lot of damage. Can he do a lot of damage? Just gonna melt here, and it will be a triple. So it's a five for three here. This is looking pretty bad for this idol. They, they went in to push the tower without any detection at all. They weren't prepared for the moonlight shadow at all. Gonna get two five. This idol evaporate. Hirana can't get armor. Even though I think Hirana is not a really good carry, but with this much farm, 
I would say she's a carry. Jam gets picked up by Skyrath mate. Finally, finally. Oh, butterfly is done on me, Rana here. Well, now I think in serious idols should consider camping in their base, try to defend high ground instead of smoke up and walk into the five of uh, Ron. And the goal difference here for as well right now, look at this goal difference. It was like um, favoring in serious idol at one point, and now it's dropping back to uh, Veron. Probably around 8k favoring Veron. People is still farming up his so close to level. Five. And they have smoke here. Do they? Whoa! It's gonna be a clash of clans, guy. No, clash of clans. Yeah, all right. That'll be five versus five here at middle. Both are smoke up. Do they do this? Do they know this? Do they have any BK? Nope, they got. Sniper? No! Earthshaker's gonna jump out instead! Looking pretty bad for. Uh, Serious idol, they're gonna get right here. That damage coming up from from uh, Mirana doing a lot, a lot of damage. Nothing more can Serious idol can do. Well, Epic Center might get one here. Yep, he will get one. Get this uh, ice healer at least. But this Meepo is back. Got back, Radiance just push this tower. tower has uh, a lot of buyback will force on the side of Imperious Idol. So far, only one buyback for Veron. And up pretty soon in half a minute. I don't know how to read this guy. <laughs> It's a DD here. DD. Dyer's top tower is under attack. Dyer's top tower has fallen. So far, all the fights, all the team fights uh, have been favoring Veron. Um, this idol, they really need to win a team fight badly. Oshan is up. There's no way in serious idol no. Oh sniper. Nope, he's going straight for this. Eye of Scuddy. Not who needs Manta when you have high Eye of Scuddy. Thank you, gonna get picked off again. And there's a DD on Mirana. He's, hit, he's hitting like a truck here. He might just fall. Yep. So this is two down for Sirius Idol and one down for Veron. Yeah, the king, there's no way they can defend their tier 2 here. Much hoist coming up from Sniper, you know. They're not gonna defend anyway, he's just gonna red top. Push out the lanes a little bit. <laughs> Radiance bottom tower is under attack. Radiance bottom tower has fallen. Um, Alright, Veron is going to play safe. Doesn't want to push this the high ground yet. I'm not sure whether it's a smart choice. So, where are you going next? Make sure it's Eye of Scotty here with the ultimate Eye of Scotty. 
Okay, still working. Thing. For the rest. Oh, right, he's gonna go for the heart. Buying a heart of Terras in this game also means that uh, more, more HP than for life steal. Good choice. But he must get a heart because he wants to be in the front line. In this. In the front line for a sniper. Like. Hello. This idol gonna like take high ground advantage. One to put. The old five heroes are missing, so it, you see this idol gonna play really base. smoke or something why are they sticking yep they want to smoke but why do you in smoke where in serious i don't just that's pretty obvious for you know in serious i don't coming i still oh They do it. Shrap now. Right, the goal difference is going the way of uh, Veron here more and more. Now it's 50k favoring Veron. This is looking pretty bad for in serious idol. Really need to win the next team fight if they want to defend the wait. Skyrath mate is gonna get caught out here. He's gonna die, and Jam is gone. It's a pretty bad team fight for B BKB is gonna get popped here. I really don't want to go in at all. Look at this Sand King just gonna melt so fast. I, what? Meepo just gotta dive behind the tier 3 like a boss here. He's not scared of anything at all. Big epic center, will it be enough? Sniper? Sniper's gonna melt really fast to this Meepo here. Once he's get caught, he's dead. And it looks like Meepo's gonna pay with his life. Sniper's gonna buy back here. They defended their Rex, I think. Yep, with a sniper buy back here, they defended their Rex. Look at the AA too. So, that's a great buyback, I think. Defending the Rex. Veron just overextending a bit, like we were diving behind the tier three. Not scared of anything at all. There's some. Um, oh, they have some balls. This games, I'm not sure who, who to favor here because I, I think pretty much just now with uh, sniper buyback and they get a team wipe in return for Insidious Idol. That's not a pretty bad trade for Insidious Idol at all. Yep. The wards are everywhere. The wards. Got the uh, plate mail here. 
I'm pretty sure it's a shield since they already have the um, assault cuirass. Nothing much for um, Zeta's Ariel can do. They can't really jump into um, 5 of um, Iran here. So they really want the high ground advantage. So they will want to wait for Iran to come into their base and just dive hit them like just now where they were diving behind the tier 3. Yep. Want something like that again. Now, alright. Uh, Life Serial gonna change their carrier. Gonna jump into the Meeple instead. I think. A better choice than uh, Earthshaker. Earthshaker is too um, too thin. Dies too easily. Roshan, pretty long way. So I think I think uh, Veron's gonna dive behind the tier three again. They're backing off. Gonna play safe for now. Well, uh, forty five minutes in. It is idle, still um, grouping up here, and they are not farming at all. So, they don't have all the uh, map. Map control in this game here. Here this are they are playing really really safe. They're so scared. You now when uh, go out and farm here, and this is true for them, because they really can't fight outside their tier three at all. Once they fight outside their three, they really lost. Yeah. Oh, this 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 is six slot Mirana here. This looking pretty scary. And it um even though the, the um goal difference favoring we're on, but I'm pretty sure in serious idol is not out of this game yet. Considering that they have a better team fight, all right, they got a smoke up here. No, Roshan is spawning, so they are going top. People, they're probably gonna blink out really soon. Go, please, cut. Oh shaker gonna get caught out here. Oh he's that's fast hand. Not bling up. They're gonna back off. Roshan! Third Roshan in the game. And that's cheese going the way of Veron again. Roshan has fallen to the dime. Cheese on Lyster, Aegis on Meepo. Ah, Eye of Scotty is done on Meepo. Those are just tuning in this is um go for Dota 2 up. Yes, ESL ESLC so um This is the first game of today will be followed by the um Miracles plus four versus Kingdom yeah. Miracles plus four versus Kingdom. It's gonna be a good match I think. I heard has uh, Draken and then Miracle has Miracle. Alright, we're on here. However, they have the map vision here for Insidious Idol. They know they have five. Like Meepo everywhere. Meepo's everywhere. Uh, it's gonna be a five. Alright, uh, this is really important. Let's take a look at the buybacks here. Only, only. DK has buy uh, only DK and Tanking has buyback on the side of Institute Idol.
around here just kind of red and red like they're meepo so and just red they know in serious idol gonna uh, group up just gonna keep one meepo here and the rest of the meepo gonna red really want to push this they're gonna jump onto this really far and this this tuska is so out of position and he's dead I see a buyback he has buyback he's gonna buy back right away and Veron, Veron's gonna. I don't think he should back here. He have the advantage. That was Yolo. Arrow's gonna lash onto this uh Tus. Kind of mage, and he's just gonna melt right away, and he has no buyback. Next on the list is the Tus. Oh, great epic center will be enough. Will it be enough? And Mirana's gonna fall here. Do they have any detection? They have no detection. It's, they forced a lot of buyback here. Who is back here? Who is diving so far behind the throne here? Meepo, please. Please, Meepo. But they will kill this sniper here, which is a dieback. And DK is gonna get hex. He's gonna die here, I think. Yeah, he buyback. He has buyback. He's gonna use it. But he has no dragon form here. He's pretty much useless. Oh, they call it the GG. So, uh, sniper DC. It's a GG, guys. Um, it's a better one. And Veron's gonna take the game here. This was a really good game, I think. What really went wrong was the I think really great um aggressive trialing coming up from um Baron. And Sniper just couldn't do anything. He couldn't get any farm at all. They're just being too greedy for Insidious Idol. So. GG well played to both team and the finals is ten twenty Yeah the finals. EMSGT. Tune in. Have a great day everyone. See ya.